Tornadoes, severe floods, and hail pummeling communities in the South and Midwest. Violent tornado. The twisters ripping trees from the ground and reducing homes to rubble in Tennessee. Here, one hour south of Nashville, six buildings on this one property completely destroyed. One of those buildings thrown 30 yards from its foundation before the tornado ripped through this house. Now power crews are working round the clock to restore power to the tens of thousands of people here who lost it. People here are now confronting the storm's heartbreaking aftermath. My bedroom's in that area. Tammy Johnson still lives in the same house she grew up in. She was in bed with her dog when the tornado tore through. What was going through your head when all of this was happening? That I was going to die. To be honest, that's the only thing I could think of. I was going to die. Nearby, 10 year old Asher is fighting for his life after getting swept into a storm drain. Tonight, the community is praying. We pray and lift up Asher. There it is. From Oklahoma to Alabama and Michigan, almost 80 tornadoes have been reported across 17 states in the last three days, causing widespread damage. Large tornado. Back in Tennessee, Brianne Lovett took cover at home. The next thing we knew, we heard just, just seen Scott, and my house is gone. This is just gone. Rescuers had to use chainsaws to remove them from what's left of their house. This morning, she still hadn't found her mother. I just want my mom to be okay because I didn't see her house. Her house is gone. And Priya, hard to believe, but the threat for severe weather isn't over yet. That's right. As many communities are grappling with destruction like what you see behind me here, more than 30 million people here in the south are bracing for yet another night of potential severe weather. Lester. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.